dash dot dash dot dot dash is KU. Uh, yeah, but what does like is CA? I what? How am I supposed to know this? Do I just have to guess, I guess? I don't... I, don't uh, I think it's one of these things where if it was like in Japanese culture, you might know this, but I don't... I got no clue here. Decide again. All right. So it's not Buddha. I know that much. It's not translating. <clears throat> Is it translated Japanese? I, I don't know. I do not know. Okay, freeze. Beeping comes gradually louder. Yep. An X, an X, an X. Try again. 50-50 chance. That's fair. Okay, it doesn't mean Buddha. Let's try soul. Safe, okay. Alright, fine with me. I hear a quiet voice. Point to your soul. What? I... I... Um... Um, um, heart? Dead. We're dead. We're dead. Okay, no, we're dead. Must be head, I guess. Darkness set in my throat like I Uh huh. Yeah, this is SOS. Yeah. the only Morse I know. Heart. Uh, yeah, it's not heart. It's, uh, yeah, no, I tried heart. It's not heart, apparently. What in the hell? I'm gonna have to look up stuff in Jap for Japanese culture, maybe. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I thought it would be hard. Yeah, me too. Unfortunately, uh, wrong. Alright. We'll decide again. The beeping is SOS. Oh. What? Save our souls. I mean, yes, that's what SOS means. Um. try now. That's why soul is right. Oh. Oh, okay. Um. Uh. <clears throat> Point to your soul. I'm going with head. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, survive that one. The beeping suddenly stops. Oh, good, good. Ah. Uh, Hiru seems terrified. Hey, Hiru, are you okay? 
Uh, yeah, I'm fine, obviously. Huh? She's acting different than usual. Let's go. I think it's fine now. Uh, understood. Uh-huh. It's another patch on the wall. Look. I might as well stare the way the poster. End up drying out my eye. All right. I feel is just going to be old blood. Yeah, okay. I hate how tiny her eyes are. What do you mean, Anubia? Hmm. Opened the door and went inside. All right. Okay. Okay, then. Oh! Oh. I don't like this. The air in this room is musty. At first glance, I'd say it's part of a medical facility. Fair, 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 fair. Um, yeah. Can we get out of here? Maybe? This is an operating room. They shrink so small, it's unsettling. Ah, fair. Okay, fire, fair, Nubian. And the smell. Ah, I thought so. There it is. Shine the light over there for a second. Oh! I shine the flashlight as directed. And find a corpse. Peter crouches down and begins to study it. Usually, Hito would be terrified, but at least for now, she's fine. Morgue? Oh. So you're fine with stuff like that? What? We all have organs and bones inside us, don't we? Only an idiot would be scared of them. Hiru, scarf Hiru skillfully examines the body. When they're done, they stand up again. To be blunt, the corpse is odd. What really draws the eyes is that the cervical vertebrae has been severed. But the cut isn't normal. It's like it's notched. The only thing I can think of is that it was cut with a non-surgical tool. I have no idea why anyone would do something that cruel, though. In any case, it's clear that the head was purposely severed. The head was severed with a tool, huh? The corpse is too old to tell everything. There should be a clue nearby. It'd be best to search the room. Yeah, good idea. Okay, so what we always do. New info was added to the spirit file in the lab. Oh boy. Check that after. I'm, I'm sneaking more snacks. Huh? Huh? What? What? Chainsaw? Why random chainsaw? What the hell? Okay, apparently that was nothing. Thanks, game. Thanks for that. Okay. Well, hi, Granny. Hi, V4. I'm not your Granny. Yeah, War Song is unintelligible. What was that? I don't know, Anubian. I heard that. Looks like it's been a number of years since this person died. The dried skin gives the appearance of a mummy. The cut by the neck is jagged. It must have been cut with some kind of tool. Well, I'm glad to know you all heard it, too. Okay. I'm not crazy. Oh. Okay. Whoops. Hmm. It's a cabinet with a glass door. Looks like something's inside. Alright. Open it and search around. I find bells attached to a handle and a notebook with a black cover. It's titled Disposal Vat Management Record. What? I flip the cover open. Dispose. 200. Super Dimension. Suddenly, Iron Door. Half spiritualized. I... I'm sorry, what? Super Dimension? Huh? 
Have spiritual... What? Hypothesize. Focused mystical forces need sacred object to erase. What? What? Press the wrong button in... Okay. All right, Anubian, hang on. Stretch. Okay. All right. Oh. Oh. Posture's fine, and I need to refill my drink. One second. Let's just reach over here and let's. Granny, why are you lewd? I'm not lewd. What are you talking about, V4? How am I lewd, huh? Huh? You want to fight? Huh? You're making noises. Yeah, I'm stretching, damn it. I saw a nip. You did not see a nip. I'm guessing the Morse code was the half-spiritualized door. Maybe? I don't know. Safety valve release code. Diamond. There's nothing else written. Got Kagura Suzu Bell's disposal vat management record. What in the world are these notes going on about? Disposal half-spiritualization? I don't understand half of these words. Plus, those bells I found don't fit this place at all. <clears throat> I closed notebook and put it in my bag. Just then, something tangles around my hand. Huh? What? Wait, what? It's a thin thread. It seems to be human hair. I'm sorry, what? It glitters pale gold in the light. What? The mark starts sucking at my blood. Ah, ha, 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 wa, ha. I ignore it and instead stare at the shining hair as if being pulled in. It's odd, but I get the real feeling that... This moment. No, it's here, this place. I... I... I've been here before. What? You're remembering something? I... Early dawn, a few hours left until death closes in. Go away! Mumble, mumble, mumble. Someone mumbles right next to me. Wait, that's not someone else. That's my own voice. Whoa! Uh, hi, Rain. Alright. Hi. Hello. How are you, Rain? How you doing? Always a pleasure seeing you. Mm. Excuse me. You're about to die. I don't think so, Anubian, but we'll see. As I thought. It's here. The words pour out from deep inside. I have absolutely no knowledge or control over them. Memories that aren't mine. Words and feelings I couldn't possibly know are falling from my lips. <clears throat> I'm good. How is the DZ? I'm doing pretty good, Rain. Pleasure seeing you. How goes the uh, continued... How goes the continued descent into insanity that is uh, the... the, the, the 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 hyperdimension Neptunia games, huh? Check the disposal vat. It must be behind that wall. Felt weird when standing in front of that wall. 
Huh? Wait. Mr. Ka Mr. Kazuo, what are you talking about? The instant Hiru speaks, the voice stops. It's nothing. I just remembered something important. You sure you're okay? You were mumbling some strange things. I'm fine, really. Just spaced out for a bit. Zanon is hairy damn before God damn, oh god. It is indeed a descent into insanity, but minus a few emulation related bugs, so far so good. Well glad to hear it, Rain. My god. For better or worse, Hiro didn't clearly hear what I was saying. Still though, that voice. Could it be that my old self, the one I lost along with my memories, was talking to me? The feeling I got when I saw that golden hair, hair. Maybe that's what triggered it. Oh. I haven't heard that other grinding voice for a while now. I guess all I can do is rely on my old self. The disposal vat beyond the wall. The voice said to find that. New info was added to the spirit file in lab number one. Okay. The cascading music box. Music was nice at least. Oh, okay. Well... Um, okay. So, no. What else we got? Anything else? Ooh, there's a thing. It's a metal cabinet. Some of the doors are open. Most are locked tight. Let's check it. I search the ones that are open. I find a notebook titled Research Records and an Army Short Sword. The letters in the notebook have faded, but I can still read it. The experiment miraculously succeed. This divine protection... The Ura statue, onated from H Shrine, created by line statue makers, using chisel, donated by same family, sever head. Severe head? Sever head? Tool, together, becomes the key. Finally, our dearest wish. There's nothing else written. Got research records one. Projectile short sword. Projectile short sword? I'm sorry, what? I'm sorry, what? Not the war music. You have a weapon now? Uh, sort of. It's in our inventory, but we can't equip or anything. What do you mean, projectile short sword? A chisel? Like for sculpting? Yeah, most likely. I impossible. How could they do something like that? That's just impossible. Stop saying it's impossible, goddammit. Ooh, 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 okay. Here. I open the wire mesh door and peek inside, but I don't see anything. I go to close the door and see a paper stuck to the backside. I found a worn out talisman. When I pick up the worn out talisman, I feel warmth flow through me. Soul power! The worn out talisman crumbles silently in my hand. Alright then. Alright then. Uh, okay. We'll save. Uh, save over number six. Okay. Check our bag real quick. Um. I. What is a projectile short sword? Are they sure it's not a large dagger? I mean, translation, who knows, but let's see. Kagura Suzu Bell. A bell used in ancient Shinto dance rituals. It has three sets of small bells. Negative seven, five, and three. Oh no, seven, five, and three. Also called a Miko bell, it's meant to be used by shrine maidens. Command, shake Kag Kagura Suzu bell. Range long, okay. Disposal vat management record. Key item, dispose 200 super dimension, iron door, half spiritualized, hypothesize, mystical forces need sacred object to erase, safety valve, release code, diamond. Okay, so I'm going to guess the Asura statue donated from H Shrine, created by uh, statue makers using chisel, donated by the same family, silver head. Tool together becomes the key, our dearest wish. Okay. Wait, a prototype weapon developed by the army in the shelter. A spring is installed in the hilt, but it's so flimsy that it's destroyed after one, after one use, so it was never officially adopted. Shoot sword blade. 
Okay, this is just a projectile knife. This is this is the this is the um the, this is the ballistic knife of the uh, the Russians, so to speak. That's all this is. The bull is a ballistic knife, basically. All right. You shoot the blade. Yeah, you can. Okay, either way, I think we found everything. Double check him just to be safe. Okay. Alright, backing out. Turn around and move. Look at the spirit. Oh, right. Thank you. I forgot about the spirit files. Alright, cannon soldier. <clears throat> In the lab. The research lab looks more like an operating room. The state it's in suggests that inhumane experiments took place here. I'd really like to leave this place, but we need to thoroughly check for any documents or tools left behind. Hatred clogs the air here, making it more dangerous than any of the other places we've been. We could be attacked at any time. We must be prepared. In lab one, we find documents in a Kagura Suzu bell in the cabinet. Files say something odd. Spiritualize the door. Release with sacred object. The Kagura Suzu bell is probably considered one. We also learn safety valve release password is diamond. I'm bothered by a thin blonde hair found between the pages. The moment I wonder if a foreigner was here. I hear a voice. Unconscious memories. I hear a voice saying check the disposal vat. What the? It's not the usual whisper in my ear, it's my own voice. I have no control over my mouth as it moves on its own. Are the fragments of memory causing this? It keeps going. It's probably behind that wall. So weird, it's like I have some special power. Oh, you think? Hmm, maybe? Huh? You think that could be a thing? Maybe? Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Uh-huh, uh-huh, uh-huh. <laughs> my god. I, I wonder. Hmm. Uh, okay, that doesn't do anything. And if I feel it, nothing happens, I'm assuming. Yeah, I know. Alright, fine. <clears> hmm. <throat> Ow. Let's go right this time. Well, go forward, I guess. Although it looks like it's just more tunnel. You okay? Yeah, uh, no, I'm okay. I'm just thinking, I guess. Uh, sorry. <laughs> kind of zoning out a little bit. Okay, I'm gonna go back. And try up, because... Uh, because of the, the increased intersection. I said ow? Did I? I don't know why I said ow. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Rain, help. The RPG, the JRPG brain rot setting in. So the only thing we can check is the door. 
Hello, Darcy. How are you? I hope you're doing well. All right. Hang on. Hang on. Hang on. Let me. Let me. Let me. Okay. Posture's fine. I'm not sure I can help with that. My mine's semi-permanent. Oh. All right. A little stressed since I'm in charge of Thanksgiving dinner. Oh no. I'm sorry, Darcy. Oh my. Uh, okay, snacky. We both suffer from it. Just from different franchises, that's all. Hyperdimension Neptunia for you and Disgaea for me. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oh my god. It's a thick iron door. The keyhole isn't rusted. I could open it if I had if I had the key. Oh. So we, we don't, we need a key. Okay. Well, all right then. I guess we can only go the other way. Dude, no dude. We no duding tonight. Might be able to doot, but no duding. Okay, all right, check this hallway. There was nothing, right? Nothing. No dude. No dude. But dude, okay, stop it. Stop it. What was that? I peek into the waterway and see something floating. I reach for it as I hold on to the edge. Somehow I manage to grab it. I found a worn out talisman. When I pick up the worn out talisman, I feel warmth flow through me. Soul power. But dude, it's so much fun to do, dude. Oh my god. No. No. <clears throat> no. I'm not some printy. Pipes are going again. The dried blood is blackened on the floor. There's quite a lot. Whoever left it probably died. Fair? I suppose. Let's try left. We go north at the intersection and... This must be the one they're talking about. Half spiritualized. An outline of a door is flickering faintly in the wall ahead of us. Hey, look at that. What? What? Impossible. It... Is it another ghost thing? Huh? You can't see it? S see what? Looks like Hiru can't see the door. Mumble, mumble, that's the spiritual. My mouth begins mumbling words that I don't recognize all on, on its own. Oppose the spiritual with spiritual. If you touch it with a tool that honors the gods. Ah, uh, all right. The little words out of my mouth stops. Touch it with a tool that honors the gods. Info was added to the spirit file. Flickering half spirit door. Oh, great. Well, all right. It's fading in and out. Like that door's kind of there and kind of not. Yeah. Bells, yes. Maybe. I'm gonna look around a bit first. Because this game is all about looking around and finding every little detail. Hmm. 
What the hell is wrong with me? I keep zoning out. My god. Okay. 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 Door. Okay, it's gotta just be the door then. Look, it's hard to make it out clearly. Is this what half spiritualization is? Feel? I touched the door, but it just feels like a wall. Seems the door has no substance. Hmm. Do we use the Kagura Bell? Okay, before I do that, we're gonna save. Uh, yeah. Okay, now we'll do it. Tool. Kagura Suzu Bell. I take out the Kagura Suzu Bell. Is just touching it okay? No, have to mumble, mumble. Strange words swift from my lips again. It's the priestess's tool. If a man displays spiritual power, it'll be destroyed. So touch it silently. All I have is questions, but I have no choice but to trust the other me. I touch the bells to the door carefully, making sure not to make any noise. What in the hell? Ho door. It's fine, DZ. Zoning in. It's fine, DZ. Zoning in is overrated in the first place. Oh my god. Stop. Ugh. The next instant, the door physically appears. Well, all right then. Good. I knew I was a bit tired tonight, but I zone out. What? What, what, what just happened? What, what did you do? It just felt like it was the right thing to do. But, I stare at the door. I sense an alarming presence. According to my own voice, if I can call it that, the disposal vat is beyond this door. I found some documents about it in the room with the operating table. It might be good to go through, go, to look through those. Let's be careful. That place is giving me a bad feeling. Uh-huh. In that case, we're not going there right now. Uh, that seems like it would be a bad idea to go there. Nothing. Just dead end. Yeah, dead end with nothing. Okay, fine. Huh. Alright. Uh, let's try... Going right. Alright. Another door. Why dead end like that? I don't know, Anubian. Is there nothing? Oh. Okay. Pitch black stains. Open my eyes wide. Stare at the white space. My poster. Mysteriously enough, I can almost see shadows what look like letters. They're not clear enough to read. Stains seem to be old blood. Crackles and breaks off in the flakes. Uh huh. What do I use the bell? I take out the Kagura Suzu bell, but what do I do with it? I don't have any particular good ideas. Okay. Never mind then, buddy. Buddy boy. Okay. Okay. Um. Try it. Open the door and went inside. Alright. 